Also, I didn't mention this before, because I... Every single let every single episode of Pikmin I, I record, just to kind of loosen myself up a little bit, get used to the new cat, or um, be able to ad lib with the new captains and have fun with that. Um, I I have a drink with me. Last time it was horchata with a rimmed glass of sugar, cinnamon, and cayenne, and today it is a Bloody Mary. You might wonder why a Bloody Mary of all things. That's that's kind of weird. I guess you could have wondered that for horchata, and I didn't have a reason. However, this time I actually do have a reason. You remember that one Pikmin short where Olimar grinds up Pikmin and drinks them through a, a straw? I'm referencing that <laughs> with my drink choice. Uh, what is this cave? I don't like this. You know what? The dog can't die. So the dog's going to scout off ahead. What are you? Can I freeze you? And then kill you with everyone? Huh. They're made of flan. Okay, you're fine. You're you're okay. Are you okay? Mm hmm. Okay, you're fine. I'm not a huge oh. You know, I am a huge fan. <laughs> I am a huge huge fan of hurting my dog. <laughs> That's awful, but honestly, I can't say anything else. I can't say that, that I'm not a huge fan of it, considering at every single opportunity I have, I hurt the poor thing. <laughs> I don't- we don't deserve dogs, and this dog does not deserve me. <laughs> this poor creature. <gasps> yes! Yes! How do I get- oh wait, what do you mean how do I get them? I'm an idiot. Uh, disband? Disband. Yes! Yes! The Pikmin variant that Nintendo hates and in every promotional material wastes no opportunity to torture this poor, sad, good boy. We haven't seen Pikmin like these before. I wonder if Captain Olimar ever encountered anything like them. The blue Pikmin. At a glance, the blue Pikmin appear to have mouth-like gills and are notably able to function even underwater. Thanks to their underwater resistance and swimming talents, I can now transport things found in the water. Now we can carry things in the water, which is what Olimar just said, but in case you are illiterate, I am going to say it to you in text. Search the water thoroughly. I'm counting on you, Jeff and Ochi. Do what I am too lazy to do because I am sitting here eating Fritos. Though to be fair, Fritos are really good. <gasps> Let's go. Let's go. Oh, wait, this first. Are those enemies? I don't think those are enemies. I think that's fine. But it's hard to tell. Olimar did say that looks can be deceiving in this cave. And so I don't really trust anything. Dog, scout it out for me. Are those things evil? No? No, they're fine. All right. You, on the other hand. Boom. Nope. That happened. Die. And die. Come here. Come on. Oh. What? Come on. No? You want help? Okay. Somehow these Pikmin are going to do the job. A little bit odd. Or I can just do this. I didn't really think that through. I could have killed them. That could have been bad. We oh, yeah, have blues. I, lo I love it. I love it. I, I like how... We find all the Pikmin types, or almost all of them. All, no, all of them. Ice we found underwater, yellows we found, or underground. No, all of them but reds have been found underwater, or underground. Why water? Why am I stuck on the water? That, that's pretty neat. Uh, we're almost through here. Let's freeze that. It only takes five. And I, I can technically freeze it with my, with my whatchamacallit. Uh-oh. 
Why do I not trust this big open air? Oh. Oh, oh, okay. I, they have to be luring me into a false sense of security. This is like, this is weird. Why are they giving me all these skitter leaves? They're 100% going to hit me with the, the variant that kills Pikmin. I forgot what they're called, but they're gonna do it. Skitter leaves are harmless, and honestly, I guess it's worth it to take them now because they, they are worth something. Why are they not worth anything normally? Please die. Wait, what are they having trouble with? Oh. Man, Colin, you gotta, you gotta chill. You gotta chill. I guess he didn't say they were, they were in combat, but you gotta chill, Colin. You know how sensitive I am about stuff like that. I should probably bloom the blues, shouldn't I? Uh, go back to base, please. And go that way, because it's the shortest way. Or, or that. I forgot you could jump. I need to remember that more. Do any of you have... No, you're good. Okay. And now that we have the treasure gauge, importantly, we have the function of the treasure gauge to detect when all of the all of the treasure has been found. Oh, you were alive. I'm... I actually kind of feel bad about that. <laughs> oh, I went well out of my way just to murk that poor guy. Whoopsie. Whoopsie. <laughs> While exploring caves, it's possible to have more than three types of Pikmin in your squad. Is that not possible normally? Why? <laughs> That's weird. Oh, uh oh. Mm, there must be a castaway nearby. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. But first, this. Ochi! Please make sure that's safe. With your dog powers. Thank you! I'm not looking forward to this. I assume freezing them is correct. trying to get a feel if you're if you're new to the Pikmin series the, my my um tentativeness might come across as strange the reason why is because Wally Wogs and you must you probably know them as Wally Hops Wally Wogs as how they were originally known in America can do that and why is that so scary? Well, a couple reasons. A, in Pikmin 1, there was no cap to how many Pikmin they could kill with that attack. Ah, that's fast. And, they have a stun box whenever they jump off the ground initially. This led to wombo combos, where they could stun your captain forever and kill all of your Pikmin and your captain. It's awful. In Pikmin 2, they capped it, but they still had the stun box. And so I fear these guys. Regardless of how much they've been nerfed, regardless of how easy they are de to defeat now, they frighten me. Oh, really? Really? In just it, two inches of water. A Pikmin got wet and needs some help. Get rid of the water fast with your whistle. T it, convince him that it is okay. And then throw him into a vat of sugary flower water. Can, uh, can blues tackle that like a geyser? They can. It is a geyser. I suppose that makes sense, and that's a neat mechanic. It also is kind of weird that... Oh. It's kind of weird that we got fire geysers, lightning geysers, and poison geysers before we got, you know, geysers. <laughs> a little bit weird. It's cool that we finally have them. Uh, this. I know this mechanic. 
just throw some yellows on it. Was this mechanic in Pikmin 3? Because it wasn't in 2. This is a Pikmin 1 mechanic. I think this is the first time it's been in the series in 20 years. Don't ask me how it works. I'm, I'm guessing they're just lashing sticks together, but where do they get the rope? How does it, how is it held up? I don't know. How do they jump that far when they've never been able to jump that far before? There are many questions. You're, you're fine. This, this ability uh, raises many questions, none of which I am qualified to answer. But you do that, because I gave you the ability to come back. I hope I get the ability soon that lets my dog go faster. That would be neat. That's a bell. Ah! It's a bell that's floating. There's something under... <gasps> Uh-oh. That's a dweevil. What kind of dweevil is that? That's a dweevil. Ah! I believe that is an anodweevil. One sec. I was right. That is an anodweevil. These are... You know, I'm going to introduce these guys the exact same way I introduced them in Pikmin 2. These are the antagonists of Pikmin 2, actually. And they can do that. Which you can imagine in a game with with lightning being an insta-kill hazard was really terrifying. However, they... Uh, ha! I love it. I love it. They, they, they're pulling out all the stops. Uh, I am going to swarm... I'm going to swarm this with you guys. You do that. And I really want to see... Here, come here. Will you at attack me? Will you chase me? Yeah, come here, come here, come here. Do you do it? You do, yes! I love, as a kid, and honestly, as an adult, I love how ridiculous this looks. I love it. With the eight legs just everywhere, the, the eight eyes. I'm so glad they kept this. It looks ridiculous. It's really funny. You gotta admit, there's there's a part of you that thinks this is really funny. And thankfully, dweevils aren't that aren't that terrifying. They're mainly- they're more annoying than anything. They can pick up treasure even while it's being carried. And they're- they just- they just cause problems, and if you're not careful, <clears throat> like I wasn't, then they can- they can wreck you. You can, they can wreck your- you know. They can wreck you. But thankfully, I am- I am a Pikmin master. Uh, they also are easier for Pikmin to attack, uh, while... They're- they're easier for Pikmin to, uh, to attack while they're holding on to something, which makes their annoyance a little bit less egregious. But, they don't lose any health while they're being attacked. Or while they're holding something being attacked. Oh, this is stupid. Uh, I wonder if I can- there's no shot I can freeze this. Also, it requires 10, which I didn't bring, because I'm an idiot! Uh... Ooh, actually. Shortcut. You do this. Oh my word. The lag on this. Uh, switch back. Almost done. Ish. I wonder if I, if I freeze that, will the Wally Wog have a problem with it? I'm, I don't know. I have no idea. I mean, we're about to find out. Uh, I cannot drop here. I can grab this Kiwi. I'm gonna throw Yellow Pikmin at this, just in case they can't be thrown back up, but I think they probably can. Okay, you you stop doing this. You swarm them. Them. And then you throw... Oh! Did I lose Pikmin? I have a feeling I lost Pikmin. Did I? I don't remember if I had 55 or not. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. I don't know if I lost Pikmin. Did I just lose a ton of Pikmin? No way. No. No. I don't know. I think I did. But why would I have exactly 55? Oh, guys. If I lost Pikmin like that, I'm I'm legitimately upset. There... Dweevil? I didn't even see him. Where was he? <sighs> Checking their ID, I hope it's another rescue officer like our doctor or pilot or even my my sous chef. 
Dalmo. He, lo he loves animals, and they love him. A researcher at heart, his passion for other creatures is as genuine as his smile, which he's not using in his profile picture. Um, he appears to be an animal enthusiast. He must have seen the voyage log and came here looking for new species. Luckily, we found him before he got, well... Hmm. Eaten. How lucky he Aww. is. How many civilians decided it'd be a good idea to go traipsing off to this planet? Did they think this was some kind of hot tourist destination or something? So help me if I lost picking to that. We're not gonna find out. I mean, I, I don't... I don't remember. I don't remember if I had 55. And if if I didn't, why did he attack? But some of our yellows have leaves, which makes me think that maybe there's a hope. And he's damaged, so maybe he just knocked off some yellows. And miraculously, they went after him. If so, Yellows are are badass. Like they saved my run. Cuz without them I would have to start over. I wouldn't I wouldn't actually do that. Uh yellows, I don't need that many of you. Okay, let's let's salvage this. Let's not make our fir have our first mistake dictator second. We have this Wallywog. I would like to lure him out of the water. I'd rather not freeze. They're super fast in this game. Like look how fast that is. But that makes sense considering... Freeze him. Kill him. That makes sense considering how... Oh, that's it. No, go on that. You... Thank you. But that makes sense considering how, like, I don't know. How power crept Pikmin are, I guess? Because they definitely are power crept. Okay, you can do that. Uh, yeah, you guys can do that. Just do it all. You guys can... Uh, you guys can do that. And then... We're good to go? We're good to go. Alright, we're fine. Ice about to melt. Pikmin better not run into that. I don't remember where the, uh... It's over there. And by over there, I mean over here, because I am a master at cutting. I'm really worried. I does It, it shows us in the map transition, right? If, if I lost Pikmin, I'm taking a big ol' swig of this, of this Bloody Mary. It doesn't show it, so we won't know till the end. If, if you, the viewer, know that Pikmin didn't die, then you're, you know, this is isn't really tension at all, because you have the benefit of, you know, being able to rewind. But for me, this is nerve-wracking, because I've set myself up, I've hyped myself up, and I honestly, if I expected, when I expect to lose Pikmin, I expect it to be too, you know, a, a difficulty spike, like a boss, like whatever that is. Not to, not to not seeing an enemy, that's just not how I want that to go down. Okay. I don't know how that fit inside of an egg, but, uh, sure. Oh, that's not floor like It looks kind of like floor like Uh, we're gonna throw... Five here, and we're gonna leave... How does this work? Leave all but Ochi here. That's not what I want. How do I just dismiss Ochi? Because that's very useful. Like, can I just send him there and not have him come back? I don't want you to... C I don't want you to come back. Ugh. Um, you know what? Let's, uh, let's do this. Let's, let's do some stuff here. Uh, let's disband. Everyone bl but blue Pikmin. And I want blues, and I want a couple... What? Why did- what? What? There. I want this. And then I'll switch. I'll take them. And I'll stay here. Uh, I'll go over here. Oh boy. Oh boy. 
No, no, no. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be smart. I, I, or I'm gonna be brave. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Not punished at all. Die. Freeze him. I, we have yet to see his attack, and I'm kind of scared. And then... You take over that. And then we're gonna whistle you as well, as soon as you're done with this, and then I'm gonna switch over captains. Well, actually, I'm gonna tackle this first. I don't have, I'm not my, you know what? And then, wait for it, wait for the cooldown, wait for the cooldown, wait for the cooldown. I'm gonna, I am going to play scared. If you think I'm gonna play scared, I will play, I won't play scared as soon as I have my first Pikmin death. That's when all bets are off, and you know, I'm, I'm playing like someone who's ready to accept some losses. But for now, when I have yet to lose a Pikmin to my knowledge, I'm gonna be, br I am going to play very scared. Which Pikmin would be f best throw? Hmm, I, I wonder. You gonna do that? And while that's taken care of, we'll send them on this, and uh, I guess we'll put them all on this. That makes sense. Yeah, we'll, we'll put them all on this, and then Ochi, you will go back to base, and we'll switch over to, to Jeff. You know, the captain I kind of regret having named Jeff. But, you know. Whoops. There's some floor lick. I'm a little bit nervous about this, but... Freeze him. We're fine. Again, I've yet to see their attack pattern. I don't even know if they can kill Pikmin. I don't know. I'm playing very scared for, you know, essentially no reason. I don't like that there's only one Pikmin on that. I'm pretty sure I said five. But at this point, I'm getting very, uh, I'm getting paranoid that I'm losing Pikmin off screen. But certainly, my captain would mention it if I did, right? Right? Right. Certainly. Okay, uh, we're gonna do this. Leave all but yellows. You are going to go this way. And you are going to get ready to fight this but are not going to fight it because it's scary and big. Actually, I could probably fight it. There. Okay, we did that, and we'll head back. And if they stay there, yeah, they can help carry that. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I, I have a good streak, and I'm... Actually, I want to jump on you. Dash! Oh, there's the boss. <laughs> okay, but is one of these fake is my question. What? Ah! Ruin! That's a dirty trick. Die. Ooh. Neat. That was a dirty, dirty trick game. I'm not a fan of that. That's some Pikmin 2 stuff right there. But, but like, not RNG, so you know it's just the dev designers being mean. Oh, it's them! The desiccated skitter leaf. How many were there? Four? Hold up. Hold the phone. What? <laughs> Let's play some Metal Gear here. Are you ready? Go! Oh, they ran away from it. Oh, there are a lot of them. They're so scary for someone who doesn't want to lose a single Pikmin. Okay, watch this, watch this. Boom. Okay, okay. Oh! <laughs> that was not intended, but I'm going to continue the, the... I'm going to continue the streak. 
Will my dog die of hypothermia? <laughs> uh, that's, um, that happened. <laughs> Whoops. No, don't throw him in that. Boom. Die, 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 die. We're fine. We're okay. Are there any left? We didn't lose a Pikmin. And because we didn't lose a Pikmin, and Ochi's honestly just only minorly crippled. He just got hamstringed a little bit. And I think that's okay. A little bit of hamstringing preceded by hypothermia has never killed anyone. I don't know what he's complaining about. Also, that... Wow. Ha! <laughs> that worked out. <laughs> cool. I don't remember if there are enough, so I'm just gonna... Oh, that's a lot of... A lot of microplastics. That's insane. Sure, let's just start throwing them. That's crazy. That's a lot. <laughs> this poor dog. This poor dog. And that one wasn't even the enemy. That was just me being a very bad master. Like a really bad master. Where am I? Hold up. I'm supposed to get through here, right? How? Where's the button? It's not that. Weird, man. How am I supposed to get that? It's, it's shut off. No, that's, that's weird. There's no button anywhere. The only thing I can think of is this. Like, for somehow this is a lever. So I'm gonna throw a Pikmin on it, just to make sure. No? Huh, I, I wonder if we're meant to come back here. Odd, my poor dog. My poor dog, why does he follow me? Why does he follow me? I wouldn't follow me. Just kind of. Jeff's kind of a monster. The final sublevel. If there's going to be a boss, our first boss, it's going to be here. And he even yeah. smells a castaway. <laughs> He's trying to find an owner that will take care of him better than I have. Uh, this poor guy. Hey, at least... I allow you to live. That makes me a good owner, right? Right? Yeah, I'm a good owner. I love dogs. Uh-oh. You know, Ochi? You are a valuable member of this team. I wouldn't be able to do this without you. Okay, karma averted? All right, let's go. I don't like this. I don't like this. I won. Okay, now I now I am confused by this. <sighs> BD long legs. Whoa! It's a Gulix! It's a Gulix! The Gulix is back. This is an enemy from Pikmin One, or at least a variation of it. This is crazy! They're really pulling out all the stops here, and I love it! What a... A perfect enemy to lose my Pikmin 2. There is not! Freeze him. Good, I got him, I got him, I got him. Okay, and they're freezing him. Uh, can I attack his tail? Oh, 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 oh. I broke the ice. This is a weird attack, weird boss fight. Freeze him again. Get some good damage on him. I'm gonna use my spicy sprays in just a moment. Come on, come on, come on. It's hard to understand this enemy. I don't know if I'm supposed to be going for the tail or if I can throw water Pikmin directly at him like you could in Pikmin, in Pikmin one and three. The camera's kinda weird. 
I can lock onto that. They're giving me a lot of different avenues. I'm gonna lock onto that. Oh! They can pull them out. All right. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Now go. Go, 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 go. Freeze him? Yes. This might kill him, actually. I killed him! Yeah! That was, that was a cool boss fight, and very short. That's fine, I guess. Once again, I have overcome a yet another, you know what, here, here's some help. Can, can you guys help? There you go. I have overcome yet another challenge. Ugh. Without losing a single Pikmin. Don't you attack me. Okay, we're good. Who is this? Is this the is this the sous chef? Let's check the ID card. Franc Francois. Francois? Francois! For for <clears throat> For years, this scholar has been working to achieve his lifelong dream. Reaching mutual understanding with plant life. The rest the research task force. I had no idea there were researchers stranded here as well. Hmm. <laughs> it really does feel like every single person and their mom is here. Ochi, come on. Come on back. Come on. Come on. You know, I, I put these burden Oh, can I why can't I pet you? I put these burdens on you not because I hate you, but because I know you're capable of taking them on. You are a valuable member of this team. You your sacrifice helps others live. And I appreciate that. Can I pet you, please? No? Well, I'll just ride you. Let's go, Ochi. Also, there's still... Oh, there... Duh. There's this. Ooh, I wonder what the... This is the first real depiction of a human we've gotten. I can't wait for the treasure description on this thing. Also, this is the closest scale we've ever gotten to how big humans would be. Because this is meant to go over her face, so... Oh, I jumped down there, didn't I? Can I jump back up? No, I can't. Man! Whoops. Man, it looks creepy. And that is all the treasure for this cave. And here's the test. We're about to leave. We're about to leave the cave. And importantly, we're about to find out if I lost a Pikmin. Let's go back to the surface. And then enter another cave. I'm just gonna take a preemptive swig of this Bloody Mary. Made from ground up red Pikmin. That's why they're not here. <laughs> That's why I didn't bring any. They're all dead. They're all in the Bloody Mary that I'm eating because I just lost a Pikmin. That's good. I only care about one thing here. Not how much treasure we gotten, we've gotten, but this screen. Did we lose a Pikmin? Yes! No Pikmin lost! Day, what is this, day four? Day five? And I haven't lost a single Pikmin! Yes! We've gotten a new kind of Pikmin, a new onion, so now we can sprout yellows. We've gotten blues! and haven't lost a single one. Huzzah! Double huzzah! The number of Pikmin you can withdraw increased by 10 again. This makes me want to feed that onion even more, as well as myself. You can see I'm wasting away. What? Why can't these Pikmin come out? Didn't we have this dialogue before? Ah, uh, according to the voyage log, only three types of Pikmin can be out on the surface at any given time. What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> they really have developed a, a lot of protective traits to keep their species from getting totally wiped out. I'll buy that. Just a little bit weird. But I guess it makes sense that we have the most Pikmin here than we ever have. Let's see, we have, we have blues. 
You know what? Oh, wait, I'm capped to three. I'm capped to three. Uh, sure. This really changes the game. Oh, 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 uh, map, 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 map. Ten seconds left. Can I make it to the new cave? I don't think I can. Yeah, there's no way. Because I have to go across here and up there in ten seconds. Man, I was really looking forward to going into two caves in one day, but I guess it's... It wasn't meant to be. Is there anything else? Uh, let's... Let's exit this and drone it up. Is there anything else we can get to? Like this? Well, that's cute. Yeah, this is out of the question. That's way too far. We have to jump. That we'd have to charge twice. So unfortunate. Oh, that's, that's also cute. Is there anything else we can do? I guess we could just kind of, like, run around. Although, I guess this does the same thing. Let's just try and get towards it. And... Go. Like, maybe there's an off chance that we get to this thing. There's no way. <laughs> We're not gonna get to it. Unless we do... I can't jump that. I can't corner cut that. I wish I could. Ah, we're so close. We're like, if I had three more seconds. Yeah, man, I could have, you know, I might have been able to get there. Oh, well, yet another day of us trying to beat the buzzer and being unable to. Still, though, I call the product uh, a productive day. Any day where I get something done and don't lose any Pikmin is exactly what I want to be doing. And as I get used to the controls, don't worry, even if I never lose Pikmin in this, in this adventure, I will start to play braver and braver. Man, we got two new cat, two new characters. I'm not going to say I'm running out of voices, because I have a lot more left in the tank, but running out of voices for characters that we've seen that, you know, <laughs> I'm having to quickly come up with is, is going to be a little bit difficult. That's going to test, test my abilities. So much treasure. So many things to read next episode. <sighs> and I can't harp on it. I'm not going to harp on it anymore this episode. Notice I said this episode. But those numbers make me really happy. Hello? By the way, Jeff, if you press minus and open shortcut settings, you can assign different functions to your D-pad and to the left stick. Ooh, I didn't notice that one. Really? Can you assign the rescue journal to one of those? Of course. And then you could reference it whenever you need some uh, some quick advice. You can even assign actions like disband or select items at the push of a button. Hi. Setting up shortcuts seems like a great way to improve your da your dandori practice. Speaking of improvements, Colin, it would be more efficient if you shared such helpful information a lot sooner. You'll never know what I never share. And I like it that way.